Hello YouTube, hello fountain pen people. I'm Joe, you're watching Ink and Iron, and today we're gonna to be unboxing a little something from Goulet. You probably know what it is from my title, but let's get to my desk and pop it open. Okay, so this order came with a free ink sample. Monteverde Fire Opal. I've never used it before. Should be cool. This is a Conklin pen. This is one I've actually had before, but I gave it away and I've been missing it ever since, so... Ta-da! This is the Duragraph in a matte black finish with rose gold trim. Black Omniflex nib. Very cool, very professional looking. Very nice. I like the polished black finial and faux tail cap. Very cool. Conklin on the cap band. What is that? Oh, it says Duragraph. Very, very small. Then we have some crescent, crescent shapes, I guess, to mimic crescent-shaped breather hole. Oh, this one doesn't have it. Never mind, usually their breather hole is a crescent shape. This is the Omniflex nib, and I've never had this one before. So we will have to test it out in this video for sure. Hmm, I wonder what ink we can use. So, while I'm getting set up to write, let me post all the details of this pen, and then we'll get right to the writing sample. This uh, does come with a converter, by the way. Kind of posts, not really. And something to note, this is a limited edition. I don't know that you can see it right here, but there's only 1,898 pieces, and this is 418. I am by no means a flexing expert. Oh my god. Sorry, I was not even in focus. <laughs> Conklin. This is the Duragraph with the Omniflex nib. It's a pretty nice nib. It is steel, but it is cut in such a way to allow it to flex quite a bit. Now we can appreciate this ink a little bit. Hopefully that's bright enough. Let me see. 
like kind of some orange to red to brown shading happening. It's pretty cool. Seems like a nice writer. not really skipping, which is good to see. It's very wet. <sighs> wow. Cool. You can really lay some ink down. That's impressive. Yeah, overall, uh, this is a $60 pen, and it came with a free bottle of ink from Goulet Pens, so get over there while you can still get that deal, because uh, it's a really great one. I think it looks great. I know it writes great because I've had one already, but I uh, just wanted to show it off for all you fine people in case you're considering it. Sings a little bit on this paper. That may be user error more than anything, though. All right. I have been Joe. You have been watching Ink and Iron, and this has been a fountain pen review. If you want to see more of these, please subscribe to my channel. Give this video a like if you liked it, or dislike it if you disliked it, and tell me why. I know my lighting could be better. I am working on it slowly but surely, and if you really love the channel, please consider uh, subscribing on my Patreon, but I'm not going to push it too hard. All right, until my next video, bye.